All right, trial time. Back at it again. We finish the investigating. Investigating done. Time to flail about in trial. Yes. I don't think there's a more accurate way to describe Phoenix's uh, trial tactics than flailing about. <laughs> Effectively, but flailing nonetheless. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, let's see here. October 18th. 10 a.m. District Courtroom Number Four. I love the little, like, abstract version of Edgeworth I know, and the, Phoenix. Yeah, they're like <laughs> kind of just like colored polygons a little bit, you know. <laughs> it's it works. It's it totally very works. fun, oh, dude. Dude, I played a uh, Thomas was alone um, over this last week. Uh, which is a very cute little platformer if you've never played it. It's, just, it's, just, it's really cute. Yeah, it's got like it. some... Oh, uh, uh, yeah. It's adorable. It's great. It's got like a little bit of um, Stanley Parable vibes to it. Mm. I don't know. It's good. Nice. All right. The court Sorry is now in that. such... No, no, no. It's good. It's commentary, <laughs> baby. Yeah. Has the runtime. <laughs> <laughs> Had that runtime. Uh, like like, I, like it needs random it. random games. <laughs> <laughs> this was supposed to be we were supposed to get through all three ace attorneys in the summer what the fuck was i thinking i don't know i <laughs> listen listen you can get through these games pretty fast but not if you're uh, a voicing every line and b as distractible as we are exactly <laughs> as prone to random improvisation <laughs> court is now in session for the trial of mr will powers the prosecution is ready your honor the defense is ready, Your Honor. Very well. Mr. Edgeworth, your opening statement, please. The prosecution will show the court that at 2.30 p.m. on October 15th, the defendant, Mr. Will Powers, pausing there for drama, <laughs> killed fellow actor Jack Hammer in Studio One of Global Studios. It is impossible for anyone else to have committed this heinous crime. Hmm. The evidence presented during the trial will all point to this fact. Hmm. Hmm, I see. Very well. I would like to move on to some testimony. Mr. Edgeworth, the prosecution may call its first witness. Very well. I call a most familiar face, Detective Gumshoe, to the stand. Why are we still calling this guy to the stand? <laughs> we have to. He, he always <laughs> got to be up here first. Give us some information. Detective, if you would briefly describe this case to the court. Yes, sir. I'll explain with the guide map here. Let me roll it out. Ah, yes, we have a new rollout map. <laughs> I'll gumshoe. This one's a lot less detailed than the other one, I gotta say. <laughs> Sorry, my crayons broke. <laughs> oh, that's just tragic. I only that's got tragedy. The one, I only got two colors of crayon. <laughs> he would only have two colors of crayon, though, and they would both be a form of like brown or sepia or whatever's going on here. He, he definitely has a blue, though. We'll get to that. <laughs> <laughs> to understand yes. this case, it's important to grasp the layout of the studio, see? This here is the employee area. The actors did a run-through of their action scenes during the morning here. This is the main gate to the studio. The security lady that works at the studio was here at 1 p.m. on that day. Past the security station, there's a gate, see? See in the image that I'm projecting into your skulls? <laughs> yep. Past oh my that, gosh, Gumshoe, do you have this power too? Red <laughs> Everyone White had does. This ability with, oh no, that's horrifying. And here it is, Studio One. This is the scene of the moita where the body was found. Now, on the day of the moita, October 15th, there are only three people here. The victim, Jack Hammer. The defendant, Will Powers. And a young woman, the production assistant, who is absolutely innocent and perfect and wonderful. In every way. <laughs> All the production staff were in the employee area until noon. Then after lunch, the victim, Jack Hammer, went to Studio One. Right after that, at 1pm, the security lady got to the guard station. Now jump ahead to later that day, 5pm. The production staff came to Studio One to perform a rehearsal. Needless to say, the rehearsal was cancelled. On account of Moida! 
the t the time of death that's, was two thirty p.m. It's a fair reason. It's, it's good reason for <laughs> canceling things. The samurai spear found lodged in the victim's chest was the murder weapon. That's the case in brief, <laughs> but not in briefs. It ain't wearing the underwear. Okay, Anyone like to hear sure. it again? <laughs> no, that joke was more than enough. I think. <laughs> hmm. Should I listen to that whole thing again? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Why would I want to? I know. We just, we, listen, it's very complicated, and uh, Phoenix has no brain. Uh, we're, so, I think we're good. Yeah, I think I could probably fine. remember that. So the murder weapon was a spear. How medieval. Actually, sir, I, I'll have you know that the Romans used spears, and that was before yeah. the medieval period. Yes, yeah, technically a pre-medieval weapon. It's very <laughs> easy to just sharpen a stick. It's probably very old. <laughs> Shut Your the Honor. fuck up. <laughs> this case is quite simple if you ask one question. And that question is... Who put the bam in the shamalama ding dong or whatever? No, Phoenix. <laughs> What did the security lady at the guard station see? Not whatever ridiculous thing you just said. Understood. <laughs> Strike that from the record, DJ sonographer. Let's call the security officer to the stand. All right, not I'm even, going to regret this. Not even got a question. <laughs> Go shoot. No, no, he just gave us the facts of the case, I guess. Just the facts, ma'am. <laughs> just the facts. Oh, if only she would. Okay. <laughs> Will the witness declare her name? Oh, God. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, no, I forgot about this. My, aren't you a handsome fellow? I'm afraid I'm a bit flustered. <laughs> uh, your name, please? Uh, Edward's like, oh, woman. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, dearie, there's no need for you to be embarrassed. Just call me Grandma Ratter. Oh, God. I don't... I don't like it. Your name, please! <laughs> <laughs> Seems Edward has a bit of trouble getting his witnesses to say their names. Apparently that's his gimmick. Wendy, old bag, dearie. So just call me Grandma. Even when I was young, I was ready. I had name Sire Silly. The other children made fun of me. I just didn't believe it. I thought this was the mother captain of Chess Country. She called me an old bag, and I just kind of got like, first out of you. Objection. Objection. I object to the witness's talkativeness. Objection sustained. The witness will refrain from rambling on the stand. God, that caught me off guard. I was so not ready for yeah, her to no. go on one of her rants. I was like, oh boy, I, oh jeez. Okay. <laughs> I was just getting to the good part, dearie. Perhaps we can get to the testimony? Phoenix is just sitting there going, hmm, I like the way this is going. Yeah, Phoenix is just like, this is amazing theater. Like, Maya pulls out a bag of popcorn <laughs> that I imagine she always has, mm -hmm. you know? Got it. She's got to have it. And, and a burger. Yeah. But no and ramen. <laughs> no ramen. Never ramen. Mm-mm. Now, the witness was stationed at the main gate on the day of the murder, correct? Yes, he I was. And to get to the seat of the murder, someone would have to pass by you. You know your stuff, dearie. Hmm. You may begin your testimony. She sure is one hell of an old bag. Thank you, Phoenix, so for true, explaining Phoenix. the name. Mm-hmm. Just in case we didn't get that really clever pun. On the day of the murder, I arrived at the guard station at 1 p.m. Poor old Hammer and the rest had been doing a run through, uh, a run through there since the morning. I well, I had some errands to run that morning. Anyway, it was one o'clock when I got to the guard station. I was at the main gate from then until five o'clock. Now the murder happened at two thirty p.m. Right? Interesting to me, because a certain man walked right by me at 2 p.m. It was Powers! That man right there, and he was heading toward the studio! Aha. Uh -huh. You saw the defendant, then? Hmm. Very well, let's begin the cross-examination, Mr. Wright. 
Yes, Your Honor. Bum, bum, press on that. So up until that time, anyone who wanted to who wanted to could go into the studio. Well, there wasn't a security guard at the gate, no. But the main gate was locked, dearie. Blah, I don't know what happened to my throat there for a second. <laughs> You'd need an employee key card to get in. Card key? Key card? That's really the same thing. <laughs> right, the card key that I have. So what she's saying is no one who wasn't supposed to be there could get in unless they stole a card key like I did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Phoenix being the evidence that that uh, <laughs> isn't the best security system. Was there anyone at the studios when you arrived at the guard station? Okay, poor old hammer. Okay, yeah, poor old hammer. A run-through. With a spear? N <laughs> 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 I'm just imagining Wendy Olbeck just staring at Phoenix, just like, <laughs> murder in her eyes. <laughs> With a spear? No puns. <laughs> they were working out a scene between the Steel Samurai and the Evil Magistrate. They got the basics figured out by noon and were to use the afternoon for practice. Mm -hmm. Rehearsal was supposed to start at 5 o'clock. I hope everyone's writing down these these times at home. <laughs> yes. Is everyone paying attention? There will be a <laughs> quiz later. That's why poor old Hammer went to Studio One in the afternoon. Unfortunately, the quiz is for me. <laughs> It's the game. <laughs> yeah, regrettably, uh, we can't grade your answers. So. so so Powers was in his dressing room sleeping when he was supposed to be practicing. Talk about a laid-back hero. If there was a run-through in the morning, why did you only get there after noon? Oh, that gets us back into the... Okay. Yeah, well, which... Then. She's being really... She's making a really weird face about this one. I'm <laughs> very alarmed. If this was Apollo Justice, we'd have to pull out the ring and st yeah, seriously. start investigating with that. Uh, what kind of I errands? Just... Oh, well, you know. Mm-hmm. Answer the question! Phoenix, I don't think we want the answer. Actually, I was watching poor Hammer and Powers. Observing, you know. I love, I love the expression. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, uh, observing? Weren't you supposed to be at the guard station? Whipper Snapper, I told you I locked the gate, didn't I? I did my job. <laughs> That's not... <laughs> I'm not sure your boss would see it that way. Thank you, Phoenix. <laughs> anyway. I always watch Hammer's run-throughs. Always. Never missed one in all my years. Wow. I want to see a Steel Samurai run through, too. Just go back to the crime scene. Boom. <laughs> Phoenix, too soon. <laughs> I, I keep having to tell you this. Like, it's not even funny anymore. It's just you're really insensitive about all these people dying. Well, you, you jokes like that. <laughs> well, you could quit being a spirit medium and take up guard duty. <laughs> Not a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, all... everyone in this game gets pretty, like, <laughs> there's a lot of moments yeah. where there's just <laughs> some very interesting commentary made by the people in general about people dying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's very all cavalier. Right. Anyway, yes. Okay, so she was Did you see the victim her. then? Did I see poor old Hammer? Nope. He'd already gone to the studio before I got back to the guard station. Tell us what happened next. Okay, at the main gate. Yep. I hit W instead of Q. <laughs> so you were watching there the whole time? No breaks? Not even a second? Uh, of course! I'm a professional, you know! Or are you criticizing how I do my job, whippersnapper? That's right, I am. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just uh, after seeing you eat those donuts in the guard station yesterday. I can watch the guard the gate and eat donuts at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Snipper whipper. 
<laughs> Snipper whapper? Well, windbag is losing it, Nick. Why don't you raise an objection? <laughs> <laughs> objection! Windbag is losing it! <laughs> so, the witness was on duty for the afternoon the whole time. Very well. What did you see? Or did it? Or didn't see. How did you know that? <laughs> oh, ho, ho. I have my ways. That overdressed young detective told me. What makes him overdressed? What? He has. I fed him some donuts and he talked and talked. I do think he's wearing like two jackets. Yeah, that, I guess that's true. He's like wearing a, I, a, I, a suit jacket and then a, a trench coat over it. <laughs> I guess I was thinking like dressed up fancy and I was like old bag. What are your standards for fancy? Because <laughs> I would never schlubby. look at gumshoe and think ah yes socialite, you know <laughs> If you ask me that detective isn't cut out for his job <laughs> Poor detective gumshoe getting ratted out by a security guard Hold it Two o'clock you're sure? Sure as spit. Well, who was the man? Really, you should try not to get so excited at your age. You might strain something. Hmm? <laughs> now, now, don't get your skivvies all in a bunch. I'll tell you who it was. Is she a pirate now? I guess she's a pirate now. Pirate Yarr. queen old bag. <laughs> Yar, it was Powers. <laughs> so you saw Mr. Powers. That's what I said. Got wax in your ears, Sonny. Nick, this is your chance. Thanks, Maya. <laughs> Nick, yeah. this is your chance. Nick, <laughs> Nick, this is your chance. Grabs Nick by the face. Yeah, just in Nick. Grabs, grabs Nick. Phoenix. <laughs> Nick, it's your chance. Yeah, time to pull out the secret weapon. I'll say it again. It was him. Oh, oh, right. Now, well, I'll say it again so you don't bag. have to look around for the piece of yeah, dialogue. Yeah, so you don't have to skip all the way to the end. <laughs> Thank you, incidentally. All right. Let's see. Now, uh, that... does that look like Mr. Will Powers to you, especially, audience? Especially considering that Hammer is the one in the suit. Hmm. Did we determine that? Because he was dead in it, right? <clears throat> no, he was in the... um um. He's in the evil magistrate costume. Is he? He was found. In, he, was... he was found in the evil magistrate costume. Anyways, uh, I think this is what we <laughs> present here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, e to present. Don't click. You don't click it. Click it makes you look at a bigger picture. Yeah, it just makes you look at it. Yeah. Let me get this Gotta straight, get old right. bag, or er, Miss Old Bag. <laughs> just, just so that you know that I accidentally called you a name there. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. It doesn't it, it doesn't make any sense if you read it out loud. I know. <laughs> You've been saying since yesterday that you saw Mr. Powers, correct? But you're talking about the man in this photo, aren't you? D just a moment, Mr. Wright. Let me see that photo. Hmm. What is this exactly? A photograph? I've never heard of those. <laughs> well, Judge, uh we're gonna be here a while. <laughs> <laughs> we are in the far-flung future, the dystopian future of... I think this is like 2016 or something like that? <laughs> yeah. Is when this game takes... I don't know, something like that? <laughs> None other than the Steel Samurai, defender of Neo-Old Tokyo. Maybe 2019? I don't remember. Miss Old Bag. Is this the Mr. Powers that you saw? Of course! Didn't your mama teach you any sense, Sonny? Anyone can plainly see that's powers, right? No, they can't. <laughs> oh, fuck. Everything's um, unraveling. Well, I mean... I wonder? True, Mr. Powers does play the role of the Steel Samurai. But that doesn't mean Mr. Powers is the Steel Samurai. that I wasn't born yesterday no one in this court is accusing you of that miss uh or, or witness <laughs> oh judge about to get throw a little shade there <laughs> he's having trouble calling her old bag apparently <laughs> not a problem for me I hate women 
<laughs> this one in particular, more like. <laughs> <laughs> However, if you do not have proof that the person in this photo is Mr. Will Powers, do you? Oh, I, I added an if there. I don't. Yeah. No, you, you, <laughs> Whatever. Huh, nosy old man. It's a court of law. <laughs> of course I have proof. What? Huh? Even Edgeworth is surprised. <laughs> the prosecution would like to ask the old... The witness. Please make known all the information in your possession ahead of time. How was I to know everyone would be so nosy? You should be ashamed, all of you! Anyway, I showed that photo to the young detective. He told me... <clears throat> this isn't any good as evidence, pal! <laughs> <laughs> Trying to do an impression as old bag of gumshoe. <laughs> oh man. What a time to be a voice actor. What a time to be alive. He didn't even give it a second look. Oh, <laughs> gumshoe. <laughs> wow, old windbag has left even Edge for a speechless. She's good. Damn, Let's hear about your proof good. then. <laughs> Damn. She's so good. <laughs> And this is why we all pity Edgeworth. I never say anything I don't mean, mind you. That morning, during the run-through of the action scene, I saw Powers trip and fall. He broke one of the props. It was a big mess. Apparently, he sprained his ankle pretty bad. Now, look at that picture. You can see he's dragging his leg. See? Clear as day! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Can you move your text box, please? <laughs> uh, <laughs> we, we actually... I cannot... Old I, bag. I, don't, I don't see it. Like, could you, um... Can you move, move your words? <laughs> <laughs> That's how I knew it was powers. Happy? I'm never happy. <laughs> hmm. So he had sprained his ankle. Very well. Seems a little spurious, but Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. <laughs> She's got to be hiding something. I'll press her until she squeals. Squeal? <laughs> Squeaky wheel That's gets the sound grease. Like. <laughs> <laughs> As it, hold it. Um. Wait, Stepper! Hey, I haven't said anything yet. I'll have you know I'm not pointing fingers at anyone behind their backs. Everything I've said is on the straight and narrow. The up and up. You today, always whining about each other, pointing fingers this way, and that's enough to make no lady want to cry. <laughs> Mr. Wright, please, for all our sakes, try not to upset the witness. <laughs> I swear this is taking years off our lives. I think Edrith has met his match. I like that art of Phoenix there where he's embarrassed. It looks mm -hmm. like a Popeye cartoon. <laughs> It does. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he belongs with a Popeye. <laughs> he totally does, especially like with his teeth, because they, they yeah. it's drawn slightly differently in that one than it is elsewhere. That, <laughs> it's, it's yeah. <laughs> it's so cool. Uh, <laughs> press that. Okay. Yeah. Who was present at the run through? Well, let's see. There was Powers. He's the Steel Samurai. Mm -hmm. Just in case we didn't know that. Then poor old Hammer, the evil magistrate. Uh huh. And me. What about Penny? <laughs> I don't think Penny was there. Legitimately. <laughs> and, <laughs> and what exactly were you doing? Observing. Just observing. Nothing else. Oh! 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 What about the assistant? Hey! Hey! <laughs> it's Penny. Oh, she was off moving backdrops around and such. So she didn't see the run through then. No, Phoenix, no one saw the run through. That's the point. We're trying to figure out who did the running through. <laughs> ah? Ah? Maya, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being a lawyer here. Wow, Phoenix, just trying to match your sense of humor. <laughs> Trip and fall? Yes, and to think he's supposed to be the Steel Samurai. What a laugh. <laughs> so Powers sprained his ankle. I helped make it better for him, of course. Did you kiss it and make it feel better? Actually, I think that is what I did, if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> if I'm remembering correctly. You, you helped make it better? 
I kissed it. Where? Oh, <laughs> yep, there we go. Yeah, it came. Oh, <laughs> Oh yeah, Phoenix Wright is in your head, Ian. Oh, they've got me. <laughs> welcome, welcome to the hell that is this game anticipating <laughs> all of your humor. <laughs> it's just gonna happen now. Let's just skip over that part, shall we? Ian's head hurts now. <laughs> <laughs> Where was the assistant then? Don't you dare try and blame the assistant, Phoenix. Oh, her? She was cleaning up backdrops, I think. She's innocent and perfect and pure. Agreed. She is innocent and perfect and pure. <laughs> I can imagine Edward just <laughs> automatically being on Penny's side for no particular reason, you know? <laughs> it's not like it helps maybe. his case. <laughs> yeah, it, no. Well, I guess it does, because his case yeah. is against powers. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Like... She didn't know about Powers' ankle. Hmm. You may continue your testimony. And stop trying to put it on Penny. <laughs> he broke a prop? Sure did. His own samurai spear. You mean the murder weapon? That's the one. Yes. <laughs> I feel like we should have talked. Yeah, we should have <laughs> talked about this a lot before we actually get to talk about it. <laughs> the murder we're not weapon. even going to talk about it today, I'm pretty sure. I think it's like tomorrow in the case that we get to talk about this finally. Luckily, I was there with my duct tape to fix it. Well, that's why, because it obviously was fixed with duct tape. And that doesn't. Oh, that yeah. Means it's well, like I mean, listen, duct tape is uh, a miracle on Earth. Let's be clear about that. <laughs> it is stronger than, stronger than any known material. Oh, yes. This strikes Stronger. me as a significant detail. Well, maybe we'll deal with it later. Yeah. I'd better write this down in the court record. Bling. Okay, sprained his ankle. Was Mr. Powers' ankle... I hate saying Mr. Pow Powers... I know. I... Ankles. I... Yeah. Sprain... Badly sprained? Oh yeah, I just noticed that too because his name is Will Powers, not Will Powers. So that last thing, that was yeah, that Powers was incorrect. Singular S. That was incorrect. That hmm. hey game, hey game. Get your Minor shit together. spelling mistake. I win. We win. Not so bad that he couldn't walk around. He went to his dressing room to rest up after lunch. Thus the nap. Anyway, I saw him dragging his foot when he walked. Dragging his foot. Okay. <laughs> he's, he's a Dragula. Okay. <laughs> I think we've heard enough. I haven't. Well, I think we have. Haven't we, Your Honor? Well, there is one thing that bothers me. Which is? Where is this Steel Samurai costume now? Um, hmm. Actually, well... We couldn't find it. Ah. We're looking, though. Hmm. Listen, gumshoe's on the case. It's, it's not surprising that we could... And, and it's not important. <laughs> <laughs> the witness did see the Steel Samurai, yes. <laughs> and it is clear that the person in the Steel Samurai suit was Mr. Will Powers. Objection. <laughs> what about the legs? <laughs> What about the legs? I, <laughs> hmm, I suppose that's point. right. <laughs> Are you sure you're sure, Honor? Mm. Hello. I'm here in the courtroom. Hold it right there. <laughs> no, you're not. Oh, not here. <laughs> we can't take you. <laughs> oh, no. Edra's going to gaslight gatekeep girl boss me. Damn straight. <laughs> he would. <laughs> <laughs> We keep talking possibilities, but we have to agree that this photo shows a steel samurai. And I don't agree, so that means we're stalling the court case Phoenix. forever. <laughs> <laughs> Filibuster! <laughs> it has to be consensus. We have to have consensus. Majority doesn't matter. Consensus is all that matters. <laughs> Nowhere in this photo. <laughs> jury system isn't a thing yet, Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Nowhere in this photo can we see Mr. Will Powers. Hmm. That's technically true. Okay, not guilty. <laughs> the defense has a point. I also wonder if someone else not caught on camera could have killed Mr. Hammer. We have to consider that possibility also. 
<laughs> then allow me to remove that that doubt from your mind, Your Honor. Just reach in there and whoop, got it. Got that doubt. <laughs> Put it over here. Will the witness continue her testimony, please? He's like he's like holding the doubt in his hand, and then he yep. gets like some of the flame paper, and then Fwah. yeah, Fwah. <laughs> just what a showman. <laughs> yeah. No need to ask twice. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> The time of poor Hammer's death was 2.30 p.m. True? No. <laughs> Just That's going to throw off a lot of things. <laughs> the only person I saw go to the studio before then was Will Powers. The Steel Samurai. Will Powers! <laughs> no one else went there! If they had, I would have seen them. Not if they threw pocket sand in your face. True. You can never be too careful about pocket sand. Hmm. Pocket sand. <laughs> Pocket sand. So if no one else went to the studio, then it would have to be this steel samurai who did it. Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. What? I'm, I'm still thinking about pocket sand, Your Honor. I'm not ready for this. <laughs> I... <laughs> it, it wasn't the pocket sand, Nick? <laughs> My, it might have been the pocket sand. <laughs> Switching characters now. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Press. Might as well press. <laughs> it's like it's like the uh, <laughs> jump. Like so, this press. Might as well press. <laughs> yes. Might as well press. How do you know that? Press. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> I. Didn't I just explain? Sorry, I was listening to Van Halen. <laughs> I gave donuts to the young detective. And then, after some rubbish about it being a uh, <clears throat> secret pal, he told me everything. I want to have a secret pal. <laughs> I see Everyone detective wants to have a secret pal. <laughs> I see detective Gumshoe shares his fellow officer's fondness for donuts. Hey, hey, Cav, fucking cops, hey, donuts, ah, uh, super donuts. donuts. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Why don't you like, share, subscribe, maybe ring the bell to get notifications? I also have Jasper here. Go, go follow Jasper. Where can we find you? Yeah, I'm uh, just getting started out in terms of all the streaming and YouTube stuff. Uh, but you can find me by looking up Mighty Nitty. Um, might he spelled the way you'd expect Nitty N-I-T-T-Y over on Twitch and YouTube perfect and you can maybe find maybe there'll me... be something there eventually <laughs> <laughs> well I hope they go and check it out and you can find me wherever I may roam Vampire Ian everywhere you know you can also use my TCG player affiliate link to get any single sale product or accessories all while supporting the channel at the same time join the Patreon do all the wonderful things and I'll see you next time be kind to yourselves, be kind to others, and have a wonderful rest of whatever time it is for you. Bye!